Hey guys, so this is uh, day 12 of my post-surgery. So I'm gonna give you guys a quick update and uh, pretty much an overall assessment of my view of uh, the doctor I used and the clinic and pretty much everything. So give you a close up, that's my hairline. back now for my donor area um overall i feel like it's you know come out fantastic i, I really love my hairline very natural look about it um, everything went very well. My donor area, I'm not really patchy or anything. I'm very happy about that. Um, about the doctor, the doctor was fantastic. I'm so glad I did my research and I went with um, the doctor and the clinic that I chose. It was just such a professional setting. Um, I felt very safe. Um, they had, at all times, there was like six nurses, I'd say. Uh, inside the operating room with me just always you know asking me if I'm okay if I need anything how I'm doing um, I was hooked up to you know all these machines IV they're checking my you know vital signs the whole time um, pain medication if I needed it uh, like I said just overall amazing service um, so I felt very comfortable very safe um, and everything was so clean and just, they're just professional. I, I, I think that's one of the best clinics in the world, in my opinion. Um, yeah, and, and the results speak for themselves. Um, I mean, 12 days to, have to look like this, I, I think it's amazing. Um, with that being said, you know, I, I would recommend that to anyone that's looking to do um, you know, this type of surgery, you know, get a hair transplant and they give you, you know, uh, as many grafts as, you know, they can and, um, it's done right, you know. So yeah, this is it. Very happy. I'll, I'll do another update. I'll do monthly updates, but, um, that was just my assessment of the clinic and the staff and everybody was just amazing. I was very, very, very pleased with everything and the turnout so far. Um, aside from all that, um, the pain is does kind of suck. A couple of days after, just had trouble sleeping. And then afterwards, just the itching and burning, that just kind of sucks as well. But, um, you know, it's part of the process. So after this, they say, you know, in a month, everything should fall out, shed, call it the ugly duckling phase, but.